Hi everyone, Gleesa here, Made with Glee. We are outside, it is super hot. I've been out here for a while, I was out here yesterday. There is a possible tropical storm, well actually no, now they're saying possibly a hurricane that is gonna be approaching Florida over the Labor Day weekend. The entire state of Florida is in the cone. I'm in South Florida, I'm hoping it doesn't come here, but you know, I don't want to wish it on someone else, but um, we don't know where it's going. We're going to have to wait until it clears Puerto Rico and get into the Bahamas before we know for sure exactly where in Florida this thing is going to come. But I'm currently five days out from any possible impacts. So I just wanted to share with you guys that I am super busy right now trying to get everything in order because my motto in life is the more prepared I am the less likelihood something is gonna happen so you know I'm gonna do what I have to do and make sure I have it all done and then hope that nothing comes here so yesterday I cleaned up a bunch of my yard trash and got it out because it was our bulk trash pickup today I still have one more trash pickup so I'll be um, cleaning up the rest of the yard I'm not gonna put away my gnomes and stuff as of yet just because we don't know I can you know easily do that I'm just gonna have the shed ready so that when the time comes I can just grab stuff and stick it in if that's the case so hopefully I won't have to do that we'll see you know these storms are finicky and fickle but I'm gonna show you what the yard looks like currently before I do any cleanup and preps for the storm and then um, I'm gonna show you guys some clips. I went out to do a little bit of my regular grocery shopping yesterday and I was quite surprised to see that Walmart was already out of water. So I'm just gonna flip you guys around and uh, show, how do I do this? Ah, sorry, hold on. So I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna flip you guys around and I'm gonna show you what my yard currently looks like. Okay, so this is the yard. Um, I started gathering my pots and stuff together. These guys will all go inside the shed. If I know something is definitely coming, all my gnomes and stuff have to be picked up. The lady in the garden, she has been through Irma and she survived. So I'm going to let her, you know, hold her own. Uh, Buddha will definitely have to come inside. Yes, forgive that I have lots of weeds and stuff around but you know it's too hot to be gardening i really don't garden back again until like mid-september um this is i consider this my winter <laughs> in south florida when it comes to gardening because it's just way too buggy for anything to grow so um yeah this is what it currently looks like right now this is my favorite mango tree i hope it lives and survives it did take a beating during Irma and it has recovered so we'll hope for that um, that thing has to go inside I am a little bit worried about my bananas because they're still growing not mature yet we shall see what happens I will take my chances and there's another bunch about to come out over there from the other banana tree. Back there I have a Buddha I have to bring inside when if I know, um, you know, something's coming. But I've cleaned up most of the garbage. So now it's just a matter of me bringing in figurines and things that could possibly become projectiles, you know, like the solar lamps. Oh, and I am worried about my peppers. These are weary 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 peppers Guyanese peppers I have a whole bed of them it's the only pepper I grow so if something is definitely coming I will have to pick all of these peppers and let them ripen inside but that's pretty much it you guys that's what the yard looks like right now I don't have that much to do what I'm doing is just uh, clearing the shed and making sure I have space to put all these things in if they say the storm is definitely coming my way um, I hope not, but like I said, you know, I don't wish anything on anyone else, and my motto is to be prepared, so I will be prepared as best as I can. And that's it, you guys, that's what the yard looks like. I'm gonna keep cleaning, but it's very hot. I'm gonna stop right now and go inside and cool down and pick up later in the afternoon.